This deadly winter weather is our big story tonight. It's now claimed the lives of at least two people, one in Preble County and the other in Clark County. Natasha Williams is live in Miamisburg tonight. She begins our team coverage. Natasha. Well, Jack, Deb, everyone we talk to gives the same advice. Take it slow. These conditions out here are pretty bad. It's still snowy. It's still icy. And at least two people have lost their lives in part because of the conditions. Harmony Township Fire and Rescue got to the scene on Old Columbus Road in Clark County quickly, but it was already too late. The small white car heading west apparently lost control and went off the left side of the road and never had a chance when it struck a tree. We have a one vehicle fatal crash. Uh, it looks to be that speed was definitely a factor. The jaws of life had to be used to cut 28-year-old Jessica Krim from the car. She did not survive. Her brother, 27-year-old Daniel Krim, who was behind the wheel, was also seriously injured and was taken to Miami Valley Hospital. Today, uh, especially now, uh, with the snow actually coming down, it's, it's so cold that the, the roads are getting covered quite quickly. Um, I believe this crash happened prior to that. But it still doesn't, it doesn't matter because the roads are so cold, any type of moisture on the roadway can actually create ice. This driver knows that all too well. Getting here to get gas was a chore. You just get used to it and uh, give yourself more distance to stop and, uh, you know, just to space yourself out between other drivers. Now, as for the wreck that claimed the life of Mrs. Krim, that is still under investigation. Her brother, Daniel Krim, is listed in critical condition. Now, as the temperatures stay low and the roads traffic actually gets a little slower, meaning that more less cars are coming by breaking up the ice, it's expected to get even worse out here. Now, of course, tonight we'll take a look at traffic conditions and road conditions as we go along. Reporting live in Miamisburg, Natasha Williams, ABC 22 News.